Alright, hello and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode, number 667, the category is Tom Cruise. This is a 20 question trivia quiz with a question 21 tiebreaker at the very end. I will ask 20 questions, giving you details. All of the answers will be Tom Cruise movies. So this is specifically his movies. Keep that in mind. Good luck on today's quiz. Question number one. Based on the 1979 Scott Spencer novel of the same name, with an award-winning theme song that went to number one on the Billboard Hot 100, what was the 1981 movie that was Tom Cruise's first film role? The name of that movie was Endless Love. Question two. The soundtrack from what 1986 Tom Cruise movie went nine times platinum certified and also won an Academy Award for Best Original Song for Berlin's Take My Breath Away. Take My Breath Away was the main song from Top Gun. Question 3. What was the title of the Tom Cruise movie that was inspired by a combination of sports agent Lee Steinberg and his client Tim McDonald during the 1993 NFL Free Agency and a non-related 28-page memo distributed at Disney in 1991? The answer is Jerry Maguire. Question number four. At 400 Days, what 1999 Tom Cruise movie, also starring his then wife Nicole Kidman, holds the Guinness Book world record for the longest continuous film shoot? The answer is Eyes Wide Shut. Question 5. Paul Newman won the Academy Award for Best Actor for his performance in what 1986 Tom Cruise film that centered around the game of Nine Ball, a pool variant played for high stakes. That film was called The Color of Money. Question number six. After Tom Cruise's character says, I want the truth, in what 1992 film does Jack Nicholson scream back, you can't handle the truth, in one of the most quoted movie exchanges of all time? That classic was called A Few Good Men. Question number seven. In what 1983 American coming-of-age drama film directed by Francis Ford Coppola does Tom Cruise play a Tulsa, Oklahoma greaser named Steve Randall? The answer is The Outsiders. Question number eight. In Beyonce Knowles' theatrical film debut, Tom Cruise has a cameo in a movie within the movie, along with Gwyneth Paltrow, Danny DeVito, and Kevin Spacey. What was the title of this 2002 spy action comedy film? The movie was Austin Powers in Goldmember. Question number nine. 
Set in Washington, D.C. and Northern Virginia in the year 2054, what 2002 movie stars Tom Cruise as an officer at Pre-Crime, a specialized police department that apprehends criminals based on foreknowledge provided by three psychics called Precogs? The answer is Minority Report. Question number 10. Which 1988 movie tells the story of a young New York City business student, Brian Flanagan, played by Tom Cruise, who takes up bartending in order to make ends meet? The answer is Cocktail. Question number 11. What 1994 American Gothic horror film, based on Anne Rice's 1976 novel of the same name, starred Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt and focuses on the characters of Lestat and Luis in 1791? The answer is Interview with the Vampire. Question 12. Tom Cruise portrays a United States captain of the 7th Cavalry Regiment who ends up in 19th century Japan to train the newly created Imperial Japanese Army in what 2003 American epic period action drama film? That American epic period action drama film was called The Last Samurai. Question 13. Best known as Cruise's breakout film, what was the name of the 1983 comedy movie starring Tom Cruise and Rebecca De Mornay, where Cruise's character is left home alone when his wealthy parents leave on a trip? The answer is Risky Business. Question 14. Tom Cruise and Nicole Kidman play Irish immigrants seeking their fortune in 1890s America, eventually taking part in the land run of 1893 in what 1992 American epic western romantic adventure drama film? That movie was called Far and Away. Question 15. What 2005 science fiction film directed by Steven Spielberg and based on the 1898 novel by H.G. Wells stars Tom Cruise as the American dock worker who struggles to protect his kids when extraterrestrials invade the Earth? The answer is War of the Worlds. Question 16. Featuring appearances by real-life NASCAR drivers such as Rusty Wallace, Neil Bonnet, and Harry Gant, what was the title of the 1990 movie that was the first of three films to star both Tom Cruise and Nicole Kidman? The answer is Days of Thunder. Question 17. Live, Die, Repeat is the tagline of what 2014 science fiction film starring Tom Cruise who joins a landing operation against an alien invasion only to find himself experiencing a time loop as he tries to find a way to defeat them. I love this movie. It's called Edge of Tomorrow. Question 18. 
What 1989 film depicts the life of Ron Kovic, played by Tom Cruise, over a 20-year period detailing his childhood, his military service, and paralysis from the Vietnam War, and his transition to anti-war activism? That movie is called Born on the Fourth of July. Question number 19. Directed by Ben Stiller, what 2008 comedy features a group of prima donna actors making a Vietnam War film and has a scene-stealing cameo from Tom Cruise who plays a profane, ill-tempered studio executive producing the film? The answer is Tropic Thunder. Question number 20. Going on 25 years of sequels now, what Tom Cruise film franchise does he star as Ethan Hunt, a high-level secret agent at a fictional secret espionage agency? The answer is the Mission Impossible movies. All right, that is it for today's trivia. Thank you for watching today. Check back tomorrow. We're rolling right into the spooky season. Tomorrow will be Stephen King. The next day will be Hocus Pocus. That's the movie, not the, not anything else. Just the Hocus Pocus children's movie. And right after that will be monsters from television, film, and literature. So we've got a few fun trivia coming up to kind of go along with the spooky season. So stick around if you're into that. Um, shortly after that, we'll be doing November trivia and then rolling into the alphabet trivia. The alphabet trivia trace. And that's what will be going on for almost the whole month of November. So stick around. If you're not subscribed, you can subscribe. That will remind you when all these quizzes come up. You can just check back every day because usually around noon Central Standard Time is when the new quizzes will pop up. If there is a chance next month I could fall behind because I'll be in America and I'm not sure what my computer situation will be. So if I do fall behind, I will just make them up when I get back which won't be until December. So hopefully what I'm doing right now is recording way ahead, trying to get all of November's trivia done. But if I can't get them done, then we'll just have to make up for them when we get back. But I will get back on track by mid-December with Christmas trivia and all of the alphabet trivia done. Here is the tiebreaker question for today. The film soundtrack also did critically well, debuting at number one on the Billboard Top Soundtracks chart. What was the name of Tom Cruise's first movie musical where he played the over-the-top rock star, Stacy Jacks? Another solid Tom Cruise movie. That movie is called... Rock of Ages. Thank you for watching. See you tomorrow.